Toyota CEO quoted as saying, we're selling directly to our customers. New pricing strategy from Toyota. Toyota is shaking things up. Once known for being ahead of its time, Toyota is now taking inspiration from Tesla and revolutionizing the way cars are sold. Say goodbye to the traditional dealership model and hello to direct-to-customer sales. Suppose you ordered a brand new car online, just like you would order a new phone, and had it delivered right to your doorstep. That's the future Tesla has shown us to be possible. And now Toyota is jumping on board. They're ditching the middleman and selling their cars directly to customers. The result lower prices, fixed pricing with no markups, zero sales pressure, and an all-around better car buying experience. Curious to know more about this sudden step by Toyota? Got a mind full of questions? Well, in this video, we'll talk about why Toyota took this decision all of a sudden, leaving its traditional selling style behind. This bold move by Toyota CEO, Koji Sato, is a game changer. By cutting out the middleman, Toyota can streamline the distribution process and pass on the savings directly to you. This means more affordable prices and a chance for a broader range of consumers to own a Toyota. Plus, buying directly from the manufacturer means a more transparent and efficient purchasing experience. No more haggling with dealerships or confusing negotiations. You get to deal directly with Toyota representatives, simplifying the car buying process and increasing your satisfaction. But Toyota isn't the only one making waves in the industry. Direct-to-customer sales are becoming a trend across the board. Tesla is already leading the way, and other big players like Volkswagen and Volvo are following suit. This shift to direct sales is all about meeting customer expectations. People want straightforward prices and a hassle-free buying process, just like shopping online and automakers are listening. Toyota is ready to turn its business upside down, according to Matt Harrison, the head of Toyota Europe. The old ways of doing business just aren't sustainable anymore. Toyota is willing to shake up the status quo and embrace the agency model, even if it means letting go of the hefty profit margins they're used to rely on. It's a bold move, but one that could pay off big time for Toyota. This is a pretty massive change, and the biggest question is why? And the answer is pretty simple. Over 80% of people prefer simplicity and ease when it comes to buying cars. They want the convenience of e-commerce and new ways of owning vehicles. Direct sales give automakers a direct relationship with customers, providing valuable insights into their preferences. This direct connection is a game changer, as data-driven revenues are expected to skyrocket in the coming years. Direct sales not only offer valuable customer data, but also increase profitability. Accenture analysts suggest that selling vehicles directly to consumers could boost an automaker's margin by up to three percentage points. That's potentially billions of dollars in additional revenue. Moreover, direct sales help manufacturers navigate the emergence of third-party platforms, allowing them to negotiate better terms and develop competitive offerings. While the shift in their sales model is exciting, it has sparked some controversy. Dealerships and national sales companies are concerned about its impact on their profits. Dealerships have traditionally relied on selling cars with huge markups, and now they fear the agency model could disrupt their profitability. But in this rapidly changing landscape, manufacturers need to adapt to stay competitive and meet customers' demands. Dealerships are transforming into dynamic agents for manufacturers, earning commissions on every sale. It's a game changer that not only has the potential to impact their profits, but also liberates them from the shackles of managing extensive inventories, which can drain their wallets. And that's not all. Under this revolutionary agency model, dealerships will no longer bear the weighty burden of marketing and advertising vehicles. Instead, these vital tasks will be expertly handled by the manufacturers themselves. Can you imagine the possibilities? Think about it. This shift in paradigm could result in reduced marketing costs for dealerships, giving them the opportunity to redirect their resources towards delivering unparalleled customer service and top-notch repairs. It's a win-win situation. The dealerships can focus on what they excel at while manufacturers take the reins of marketing and promotion. Let's dive deeper into the numbers. Dealerships have been grappling with dwindling profit margins on new car sales, and the situation seems to be escalating. According to a study by Accenture, discounts are projected to soar by a staggering 30% by 2025. 
The consequences? Dealers could face an alarming annual revenue loss of $600,000 per dealer year after year. But fear not, dear dealers, for the commission-based system is here to save the day. Ann J. Volterman, the esteemed executive director for the German Dealers Lobby Group, ZDK, passionately believes that dealers should have a stake in cost savings. And who can blame him? After all, it's only fair that they get their slice of the pie. Now, here's the most interesting part. In this visionary agency model, dealerships will still invest in physical retail spaces, ensuring customers can relish the brand experience they know and love. It's an exciting challenge for both parties involved to find the perfect compensation system that covers the investment costs. But let me tell you, it's a challenge worth embracing. However, let's not overlook the hurdles that lie ahead for the manufacturers. Revolutionizing their retail operations to meet the demands of this groundbreaking sales model won't be a walk in the park. Their goal is to design an all-new customer experience that retains the familiar touch of traditional dealerships while surpassing expectations in terms of customer service. It is a monumental shift of responsibility onto the manufacturer's shoulders. And trust me when I say, it's not going to be a smooth ride. Today's customers demand convenience, personalized experiences, and instant gratification. They want information, seamless shopping, and speedy delivery right at their fingertips. That's why the new retail model is all about prioritizing convenience, versatility, connected technologies, and creating a seamless, omni-channel shopping experience. It's an exciting time for original equipment manufacturers, or OEMs, as they embrace these new retail models. But they also have to navigate logistical challenges while ensuring minimal disruptions to their customers. Picture this, a single customer's journey involves around 5,000 interactions between different stakeholders, such as sales teams, finance departments, administrators, and valets. In the past, retail networks handled these responsibilities, but the new retail models are changing the game. We're talking about a significant increase in interactions between customers, their mobile devices, and the OEMs themselves. However, only a handful of manufacturers currently have the necessary infrastructure to support customers throughout the entire purchasing and service process without relying on dealer networks or alternative compensation models. Take test drives, for example. In the traditional model, dealers manage all the interactions involved, but in the new agency models, it becomes the OEM's responsibility to establish a centralized base for conducting test drives, ensuring the availability of the right vehicle at the right time. Now, transitioning to the agency model is no walk in the park for manufacturers. It can be both costly and complex. They have to cater to consumers making significant purchases, take on more customer engagement activities, and manage various touch points. To tackle these challenges, manufacturers can turn to automated processes and integrated retail systems. By automating tasks and integrating systems, they can boost efficiency, provide faster customer journeys, and even reduce costs by eliminating unnecessary interactions. But what about dealerships. Well, they have to adapt and embrace their new role as service providers in this ever-evolving automotive landscape. They can leverage their physical presence to offer a range of services within a broader mobility ecosystem. And if there's an automaker that can do this successfully, it's Toyota. With its impressive infrastructure, established supply chains, and a wide network of dealerships, Toyota is in a prime position to implement the agency model and provide direct sales and exceptional customer experiences. Toyota has a proven track record of innovation and adapting to market dynamics. They've introduced new technologies and approaches to the automotive industry before, giving them an edge in navigating the challenges that come with implementing the agency model. Make no mistake, the automotive sales landscape is going through a major transformation. Dealerships need to not only embrace this change, but also take a leading role in the transition to direct sales. Toyota's decision to sell vehicles directly to consumers could disrupt traditional dealerships and reshape the industry. But fear not, as dealerships can adapt by diversifying their revenue streams. Some customers still prefer the traditional dealership experience for that face-to-face -face interaction and personalized service, so dealerships may not vanish completely. In fact, Toyota's direct-to-consumer strategy could inspire other automakers, leading to increased competition and innovative cost reduction measures. This could mean improved product quality, enhanced features, and better pricing for consumers. Of course, Toyota will face challenges in digital platforms, logistics, customer support, and marketing. Collaboration with dealerships and offering incentives will be the key to a smooth transition. But if they pull it off, Toyota's position in the mobility revolution will be secured. Dealerships will remain essential in facilitating 
improving customer experiences and providing valuable services. So what's your take on this exciting development? Do you think Toyota has what it takes to make it happen? We would love to hear your thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel for more updates, and hit the notification bell to stay informed about our latest innovations and exciting developments. Thanks for watching.